Congratulations on your new deal. How do you feel having signed this contract? Well, so excited, so happy again. Uh, it's a pleasure to work in this, in this family, in this organization, in this club, and still I have the feeling, we have the feeling, with the players uh, we have, uh, because I am enjoying every day to work with uh, them, to be with them, uh, to try to do our best for the coming years. You do seem very happy at City and you seem very settled in Manchester as well. What is it that makes working uh, for this organisation so special for you? Well, the, you know, I think I have a good relationship with the chairman, uh, with Ferran and, and, and Chiki and Omar and all the people there. It's like, you know, we know each other for a long time. Uh, Chiki is part of almost our family. And, and of course, uh, we have all the conditions to, to be a stable like a club and, and especially, you know, like a manager, you have to be happy with the players. You have to be good, feel good. And I feel good with the players, with all the staff. And we're trying to, to, be, to be ready for the next, next years. What are your targets then? What's your vision for this club and the team over the next three years? Well, I am focused on the pitch. So the club, there are uh, important people working in other departments, but on the pitch, you know, it's, it's to try to be the desire to to get in better, to to become better, better team, and that is going to to try. So on every day on the pitch to to improve, to improve our players. We have an you know a squad of 23 average, is a, a young squad, and and if we are stable and mentally. You don't believe too much what we are, so, you know, thinking about we, what we can do to, to improve our game. Maybe we can compete for the next season, being there with the rest of the teams in England and Europe. Do you have a strong idea about the kind of players you want to bring in to, uh, to join this group of players? Well, we don't need too much. I think the club make a huge effort last season, you know, uh, and I think we need one or two pieces maximum, but still the players deserve to trust in them and uh, and we're going to try it, you know, uh, to, to be together, you have the basis, but uh, all the stuff you have in mind to, to me, some <laughs> changes in the way we play for the future. You're known for the intensity that you bring to the job, you know, you love football, you're obsessed with it. Do you feel you've got a lot of energy for the next for the next few years going forward? Well, the contract and the manager always depends on the results. We have uh, we extend two more two more years our contract, so still three years, but we depend on the results. So football, what we have done uh, in one year, changed absolutely everything. And and but have a confidence with the club, with the chairman, with the cheeky. When we know perfectly, and when we feel that is not going well we're going to change and and I'm going to make a step back. I'm trying for all my effort, for all my desire uh, to avoid that and instead uh, to make a step back, we're going to make a step forward. And and that is going to, to work every every single day to maintain the level with uh, this club. Since Sheikh Mansour took over the club is, you know, the last eight, ten years the club is always there, is always there, a little bit up and downs, but always is stable. The last five or six years, the club is always in Champions League, uh, and that was we're going to try to to maintain it. But I will not be here just for 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 stay. So we have a contract because we have to have a contract. But the club knows the club knows me, and when I'm going to have the feeling that uh, our relation with the players is not good, I'm going to make a step. A step back, another guy is coming to come to, to help to the team, to the club, to the players to maintain this this high level that we achieved in the recent past. Looking just at next season then, given how good this season has been, what's your what's your biggest challenge do you feel to No, it's try to, to go to the simples. It's not to try to train good, to prepare good, to live twenty four hours as maximum as possible like a professional, not just the players, all the staff the managers and and after day by day. So I think for my experience to make a big mistake to say no we have to win the Premier League or have to win of course 
Every, everybody knows we're going to try, but focus on what you have to do in every single session in the next game, in the next game. And after our performance on the pitch, you know, will we'll, we'll tell us what is our level and in which position we're going to finish. That is our target for the next, next year. And finally, there were 100,000 <coughs> City fans at the parade in Manchester. There's many more worldwide. They're all going to be absolutely delighted with this news. Uh, have you got a message for those fans? We will work. So uh, please uh, come every game at home in Etihad Stadium. Please, in the bad moments, during the 90 minutes, please help us. Because uh, they have to criticise us and they have to make boo when the players don't run and don't fight. What doesn't happen, they are allowed to criticise a lot. But that is not going to happen with me. And like they, that is not going to happen with, uh, with all of us. So please help us because we need it, especially in the bad moments. And uh, in, a way, in a way, games, we are more than delight the way the guys who come to support us and uh, and they know we're going to try again to make them proud about uh, their players the the all the staff to to do every time to go to england or europe the people can say okay manchester city is a is a good team and that is a challenge that's why i am so happy and delight to continue a little bit longer my my period here in manchester Brilliant. Pep, everyone is really, really pleased with this news and we wish you all the best for Thank your time you. here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.